because Golden State had a classic yeah. Warriors third quarter yeah. and just blew the Grizz out of the building. And, and that's what they're known for. Yeah. And, and every coach, every team tries to prepare for that third quarter blitz that's coming out of the locker room. And, you know, you, you're just not successful with it. And we haven't seen a lot of teams be successful with it. And Golden State came out and they put on a clinic in that third quarter. You know, Kerr, I mean, I mean not only Kerr, from his coaching standpoint, but when you look at Curry, you look at Thompson, their ability to just, you know, raise their level in the third quarter, yeah. you know, the adjustments that they make, you know, inside the locker room is, is amazing. And the Grizzlies couldn't have gotten yeah. off to a better start. They hit six of their first eight three-point attempts. They were up by 13 in the first half. And from there on on, the Golden State Warriors just sort of chipped away. And then the third quarter took over until it got completely out of hand. And Golden State is beating them at their game. This is the first time that the Grizzlies, who led the league in points in the paint, have been outscored in the paint three straight games since October. And yeah. the first time they've been out-rebounded in three straight games all season long. Well, we know Thompson and we know Kerr are good rebounders, right? Uh, from the guard position and the wing position, they do rebound the basketball. But what they did also in the first half, Matt, was they didn't settle for long threes. They, they had back cuts. Yep. They took mid-range shots. They got to the basket. They got layups. They took what the defense gave them. And when they softened up the defense in the interior, then they went out to the perimeter to the three-point line. So they were able to score from all positions in, on, on the floor. And then, of course, their rebounding effort was spectacular. Yeah, that's a good point. They took 22 of their 32 three-point attempts after halftime. Only 10 in the first half really did take whatever Memphis was presenting to them and wound up with 62 points in the paint, obviously with – 142, they got pretty much whatever they yeah. wanted. In fact, their 63% shooting tonight is the second best in a playoff game in Warriors franchise history, and that goes back to Philadelphia in the Wilt days. Yeah, I mean, again, the third quarter adjustments that, that Kerr and, and his coaching staff makes, when they come out of that locker room third quarter, I mean, everyone knows what's getting ready to happen. And somehow, you know, teams, players can't, can't stop it because they just have a barrage, they have momentum, they have good shot selection, they have back cuts, they have energy. It, it just, it's pretty phenomenal what they've been able to do third quarters over the last couple of years of their run.